my magical friends, I'm Cal Mingo. Now today I'm showing you my longest ever trade inside of Overlook Bay. And the reason why it was the longest ever trade is because I traded for a monkey inside of Overlook Bay. I finally did it, I'm now on the road to get every single pet in the game. Now I'm not gonna show the entire trade to show all the offers, cause there's like 20 minutes of us basically just going like, uh, how about this pet? And then like, uh, you know. It's like never really knowing what to trade for the monkey pet, because it's just so rare. I ended up offering some really good pets, like a shiny alicorn. I offered a, I offered a flamingo, not this one. I, I have another one right now. Where is it at? It's right there. I was end up offering this flamingo. I was offering sweet tooth. I was offering all types of things for this pet. It was like the one pet that I actively could not get without trading. They even wanted to trade for a giraffe, but I didn't have one at the time, so I was actively trading someone else for a giraffe. It was just a huge mess. But I'll be showing the trade in a minute, the final trade that we ended up doing for the monkey. But I want to talk about two things before I show off the trades. First, it's the winter update. Look, it's all snowing everywhere. There's snow literally everywhere in the map. There's snow on top of the billboard right here. There's snow on top of the buildings. And even they have the train ad, the Overlook Bay train. There's even a conductor here named the Conductor. We're getting ready to make a long journey. And the Northern, the North Pole Express is getting ready for to depart. You just keep pressing, um... Tell me more, this never tells you more. Just tell the same thing three times in a row. Basically same thing, which is <laughs> really funny. But just look at the map, everything's covered in snow. There's snowmen just about everywhere. Look at these snowmen, they're so cute. I like this one, he looks just so happy, like, hey, how you doing? <laughs> it's so adorable. There's even snowballs all around the map that you can pick up. I can pick up this one, and I can throw it, like, wah! I have, I'm a, I'm a, I have a great throw, look, look, look how far I can throw, just... Wow! So far, I can't even see where it landed. And another thing in my leak video that I talked about, they I showed off these things, thinking you could pick them because there weren't fruits before, but you can't pick them out, actually. There's a lot more of them too than I thought there was gonna be, but you can't pick them, they're just decoration. Would have been cool though to get more money that way. Another funny thing too is even when the haunted house has snow on it too. But I just find funny because it's like a Halloween house and it all has the snow and everything. But a lot of them do like this one has snow all in front of it. This one has snow, little icicles. This is really cool. I love the winter update. I honestly cannot wait till they add all the Christmas stuff because that's in a couple days from now. I'm so excited. I'm gonna do so much grinding, so many pets. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Even the lakes and like some of the rivers are iced over too. Like if you if you walk onto it, look, you get ice skates on your feet and you can skate around. Even the monkey pets doesn't have ice skates, but look at him. He just jumps around. Oh, <laughs> it's so cool. And there's a little bit of slide to it. There's a little bit slidey. It's something I figured out. If you go off the ice and you just don't stop walking, it just run, makes you run like this, which is hilarious. I, just, I look like someone who's never skated before. <laughs> it's absolutely hilarious. I love it. Like, <laughs> I look like I'm in a hurry. Like, hurry, I gotta ice skate real fast so I can get somewhere. But also, if you head over to the soccer field, there's a bunch of snow piles here. Even some snow castles you can hide behind. Have like a little snowball fight. With a bunch of people. And if you hit someone with a snowball, it actually knocks them back. But it only seems to do it at like a decent range too. So you can't do it right next to them. Mainly because of the E that pops on characters. That, that little blue E pops on people. So it's really hard to throw people that are right next to you. But at distance is a lot of fun. Like, wow! Pretty cool. Oh, and one last little thing I just want to talk about real fast. Last thing I want to show about the update is if you go to the little beach area, they extended the beach practically with these little snow caps. A cool little thing is if you have a personal view on the bottom bar, you can make it across the river a lot easier now without having it in boats by using the personal vehicle. And it's really buggy, like, it stops the music, but look at that. We made it over! Pretty easy to- I, I didn't have to try that time. Normally it's really hard without these sheets here. But I'm super excited they added this. So that now you don't have to wait for the boats if you don't want to, you can just like jump across the ocean. Okay, so one last thing I want to talk about real fast. If you look at my pet collection, I'm super close to getting all 54 pets. But I'm super close. I have all the commons, all of the uncommons, all of the rares, every single ultra rare but the VIP koala. Which I'm going to buy VIP really soon because every all the game passes are like 25% off. I'm definitely going to buy the VIP. I have all the legendaries and I'm only missing one godly, the rainbow kitty corn. It's funny because I have the normal kitty corn, which is they're both on sale right now. I might buy a couple. But as you see, I'm only missing two pets. I'm so close. Hopefully, I should have all the pets either tomorrow or the next day because I do want to be able 
to show off every single pet in a video. Now, when I was trading for the monkey, which was like the hardest the one pet I was really hoping to be able to get, because everything else I can get pretty easily, all the pets I'm missing, I can just either open or trade for one of those pretty easily, because a lot of people have that one. And the VIP I can get for free just by buying the game pass. But this was the one I was missing, and it was really hard to get. But when I was trading them, I was offering a whole bunch of things. I was offering basically all the types of pets I had. I was offering Sweet Tooths at one point. I was offering Flamingos. They wanted a giraffe. I didn't have one. Alicorns. I was offering a shiny Alicorn. I was even offering a couple of legendaries alongside. Like I would offer a spider alongside with a godly. But eventually we got to a deal because there was one pet they were missing, which was the chocolate cow. Which I did have one of. I did end up trading for a another that I ended up giving them instead, right here. Which I am super excited about. I'm so glad I finally got the monkey. I'm still surprised I took it out of the game. though. It was out of nowhere. There was like no hints to removing it soon. But yes, I finally got the monkey. Thank you so much to the person that helped me get it. You are absolutely amazing. But let me know down in the comments. If you were to trade for a monkey pet, what would you offer for a monkey pet? I'm just kind of curious what y'all would offer. I literally offered my best pets I could. But thanks for being here and I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye!